Hello and welcome! Today we are in the Tier 8 German aircraft carrier, the Graf Zeppelin. We're on the map Estuary, and we're in a Tier 9 match, almost entirely Tier 9 even. Which I suppose is better than my last match, which was in a Tier 10 battle. Actually, quite many of my Graf Zeppelin matches have been in Tier 10 matches because because there are so many... well, Graf Zeppelin was on sale with the Black Friday, so this meant that there are one million Graf Zeppelins in queue right now. So it's very difficult to find the equal tier matches. So right now we're just trying to dump some planes, and then find a nice destroyer to hit once. And then pull back? Oh, Graf Zeppelin is actually visible. Well, I didn't find a destroyer, so we're gonna go after the Rune. Because he's an imposter. Oh my god, I... There's nothing you can do in those flak bubble things. Like, you just fly and the flak bubble appears right in front of you and it's an entire wall. There's literally nothing you can do. Well, you can try to hope to try to slow down to dodge it, but... I don't know. It doesn't work for me most of the time. Well, that's why you dump planes, though. Because, uh... So basically this what I'm doing right now is dumping planes and you do it because you don't want to suddenly lose all of your rocket planes you only want to lose some and when you dump your planes um, you can't lose the ones that are already flying back to your ship right so it's a good idea let's see oh okay the destroyer is actually firing here so we can actually do a strike here into this well, there's clearly a destroyer somewhere there. Well, apparently not, though. Never mind. Uh, let's go with... You know what? I can actually push here, I think. Because they don't have that many ships over here, and we have a lot more. And I'm some kind of a weird secondary hybrid build thing. Which um, I haven't actually been able to use because I've been only getting tier 10 battles. We're gonna try to drop on the Nelson with our uh, amazing torpedo bombers. Or maybe not, because she's turning away. Let's see how much on the side of them can I get. Maybe the Rune is actually a better target. Yeah, we're gonna go after the Rune. Well, she's a cruiser, so dealing any points of damage to her is more effective. But also because, uh, well, she's a better target at this point. Oh, and she's actually turning this way. Interesting. Well, she has definitely used damage... Well, actually, maybe not definitely, but she probably has used damage control party at this point. So doing a strike on her now could be more effective, because if I get a flooding, that one's gonna stick... Oh, no, she didn't use damage control party, actually. She, Her engine is still broken. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Well, by that I mean... Well, it kind of sucks, because I can't flood her again. But, I mean, uh, actually, no, it doesn't mean anything other than that. Well, anyway, she's kind of dead, because uh, she's alone now. Not next to the Nelson anymore. I mean, she's probably going to try to catch up, but uh, I find it unlikely that she's going to succeed too much. Oh, oh, actually, no, I wanted to, oh, a destroyer, but then it's, I realized it's a Friesland, and uh, that's pretty much off limits to any CB. The entire on that thing is, um, yeah, if you want to make a CB cry, play the Friesland. Nice RNG, thank you for the over penetrations. Let's try for round two. Fight. Okay, actually the announcer said it in a much more animated fashion. Are you kidding me? The bomb literally... Oh my god. Okay, let's try again. No, no. Somebody deal with that Friesland, please. Well, the good thing is she doesn't have torpedoes. The bad thing is that, well, she is a Friesland. I need to try to stop in this smoke screen here. Because if I don't, I'm gonna have a bad time. Friesland, please come over here. I want the secondary you. Let's 
drop a fighter plane and then fly away, because uh, that thing has some scary ass secondaries, or anti air. Oh, I think I hit the secondary hit on her. Yeah, we're hitting secondary. Sh and the cool thing is, she can't torpedo me! Which means I don't have to be afraid of her. Oh no, actually I'm secondarying the <laughs> Nelson. Okay then, that's fine too. Oh, and now the Friesland too. Holy crap, what is this? Is this heaven? Is this what heaven looks like? For Graf Zeppelins? I mean, I'm, I'm in a smokescreen. I can secondary a battleship and a destroyer at the same time while being able to drop them? This must be what heaven is like, right? cool thing is that my secondaries can pen the bow, all of them, of the Nelson. Oh, okay, that wasn't a very good drop, huh? Okay, I should probably start going forward. Never mind. The, uh, the destroyer was uh, destroyed. Let's just watch this and... Goodbye, Nelson. Mine. Yes. Benham. Hello. Admiral Maces, as opposed to Admiral Axes or Admiral Swords or Admiral Spears. Not Brittany, just Spears. Dead ahead. Oh, well, he didn't get the Torpedoes Dead Ahead message, I suppose, considering he uh, died. I should probably give this Tashkent a fighter plane, because he seems lonely without. I should also dump these uh, rockets, and uh, I can't do it over to city because last time these uh, pesky viewers of mine started complaining something about human rights and stuff. I don't understand. Like what? What? Like what? Aren't cities the perfect dumping grounds for? Uh, oh um, <laughs> that's a lot of stuff. Oh god. Hmm, what do I do now? I don't really want to deal with the Brindisi. I'd like to deal with the Duke of York or a Shanhorst. Or a Hood. I guess Hood's fine. Actually, no, Brindisi is also fine, especially Bow On. Jesus, Brindisi would be amazing. Anyway, we're gonna go after the uh, Duke of York with our uh, bombers. Because the Duke of York is next to a giant mountain, meaning that I can approach over it and her entire can't be effective while I'm doing so. We're also going to advance and hopefully get closer to the HMS Hood. And then we can pretend to be the Bismarck with our secondaries. Taking fire. Hello, Duke of York. Okay, that was a bit faster than I expected. Anyway, we still got our nice citadel hit. Well, Dave, how mad are you now when you're being CV'd? Okay, that second one didn't work out quite as well as I had hoped. Oh no, they seem to like shooting me. Which is something I do not like very much. Torpedo bombers! And we're still gonna go after the Duke. We're gonna make for a very... Uh, we're gonna create a very unhappy Duchess, I think. Maybe I should stop my CV. In fact, yeah, I should probably start turning north. Oh, yeah, I guess she can't make that turn, so she's going to do a stupid slow down and then reverse and then start turning. Like, why can't she do the turn, run into the island, then reverse, and it'll be faster this way. I'm not sure how good of a drop that was, though. No, it looks fine. And her engine got broken with that. So she probably did damage control party this. Taking fire. Returning. Taking fire. Yeah, see? It's doing this weird reverse thing. Like, she isn't even turning properly, which is weird. 
Okay, Alaska. Wanna get citadeled? I know your citadel is like immune to all the damage, but uh, it's not immune to... Okay, maybe not. Print easy! Actually, no, I can't say this name of the ship because people are gonna complain about how I'm not saying, calling it Brind Izzy or whatever. Actually, I have no idea what it's supposed to be. Man, Graf Zeppelin and this map seem to really agree with me. Well, okay, maybe not. Could be better than this, right? But has been rather successful so far. Yeah, I don't know. Dropping it from the side seems to just cause overpens. Mm. Yeah, let's go sink the Duke of York. And I guess the game will end at that point anyway. Oh, somebody already sank the Duke of York. Damn it! This is unfair. Oh, <laughs> uh, the Brindisi has a ginormous citadel, in case you didn't notice this by... Oh, she also, she's also really fast, meaning that I don't think those torpedoes can actually get shot, though. Well, the game ended, so it's fine. I would say this was a fairly successful battle. But I mean, I did get to secondary, a destroyer and a battleship at the same time, while being in a smokescreen. In a random battle with no team, with no division mates. Sure, I only got 1500 XP, but uh, I'm still happy about that. Secondaries actually did 17k damage. Plus, I think the fires are also from the secondary, so let's say 20k damage. Yeah, this Nelson. <laughs> 15,000 from the secondaries. Friesland only took 2k, but I mean, that's still something, right? Well, seems like my secondary build actually did something useful this time. And by secondary build, I mean I have AFT instead of uh, Concealment Expert. See? And I have the uh, secondary range instead of this thing. I'll be honest, I don't really notice the fact that I don't have this upgrade or modify. Upgrade, yes, the subgrade. And this one is pretty much worthless. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I would like to thank the patrons on Patreon. Thank you very much for your continued support. Nashira, and I hope I'll see you guys next time.